Peace, family. Vicki Dillard here. Thank you so much for tuning into The Vicki Show right here on the African Diaspora News Channel. Please make sure that you give us a big thumbs up and share the broadcast and tell everybody that you know that your sister with the curly braids is on. Family, so certainly, sadly, many of you have heard once again about the domestic war against our people. Uh, one of the more high profile cases involved a 14 year old a uh, black teenager by the name of uh, Cyrus Carmack Belton. Um, he was uh, uh, falsely accused of stealing water. It involves bottled water from uh, this Asian Rick Child's store for Shell. He has a Shell gas station. Chased a young man out, shot him in the back, killed him. And according to reports, uh, there has been non-stop actual fights and scuffles that this uh, Asian store owner has been in uh, with what appears to be an overwhelming number of black residents. So it turned into this. And some folks were actually saying that, that weapons were involved with, with the store owner previous to this, but he shot and killed this young man over a lie about water. And even if it was true that he stole water and it's not true, human beings wouldn't, mow someone down for a bottle of water and take their lives. Well, what was so disturbing was this ridiculous South Carolina resident who actually said this crazy statement. Watch this clip. By the gas station, however, is speaking up. Leroy Hall lives nearby and says she went to the gas station often. Sometimes we have to learn how to step back and step away and really process what it is that we feel so that we can respond in a healthier way. Because even though this, this right here, we gotta live with this, you know? This is not something that's gonna be taken lightly. I feel bad for both parties involved. Cause like I said, I do have a relationship with the owner, but I'm also, you know, feeling for my people, my black and brown people that are constantly going through these different types of situations. So, you know, it's just heartbreaking for everybody around the board. And, you know, I'm definitely praying for everybody. Now, did you hear her? Some of the folks told me that she's an online influence. I won't get into her online name and all this kind of stuff. But she sat up there and said she feels sorry for him, too. Both parties involved. The person that took out our brother, she feels sorry for him and says she has a relationship with him. And we just, we got to live with this. Do you all know that that energy is the very type of energy that causes us to be taken out? That is absolutely unacceptable and it's shameful. I can't wait to hear what you have to say about it. My name is Vicki Dilla. Be sure to check out my website at clubvicki.com. Join the divine spiritual movement that's changing lives and giving you real results on earth in the 3D, clubvicki.com. I can't wait to see you again.